Hello everyone, so welcome back to what is fast becoming a little bit of a birthday week here on my channel. Kind of taking myself some liberties there, extending my birthday as long as possible, turning it into a birthday week, but why not? So as you may have seen, my birthday was on Sunday the 25th, I was 25 on the 25th of June. I liked the symmetry of that. So I'm gonna film what I got for my birthday for you today. I love watching these videos, they're one of my favorites because I think I'm just a little bit of a nosy person, um, but I also really love to get gift ideas from these videos, so I think they're really helpful for that. And at the end of the day as well, I wanna remember all these really beautiful, lovely things that my friends and family got me, um, and look back on them, and just have that kind of memory here preserved on YouTube forever and ever. Let's hope forever at least. So without further ado and disclaiming, um, I'm just gonna get into showing you everything that I got for my birthday. I wanna start with, I think, some of the books that I got. I usually do get books on my birthday, because people who know me well know that I love books. Um, and this is the first one I got. This was from Darren, actually. This is Almost Adulting by Arden Rose. I love Arden's YouTube channel, and I was super excited to see that she was bringing out a book. Um, I also just think this is the most beautiful book ever. I love the illustrations on this. It's so, so cute. And uh, it's called Almost Adulting, All You Need to Know to Get It Together sort of, <laughs> which I think is kind of very, very relevant and something that I will enjoy reading. He also got me this uh, journal. I think this is from Urban Outfitters. I had spied this before. It's a daily journal and it's peach with peaches on it. Super cute, I love really cute stationery. I'm not a massive journal user, but I really want to get into actually writing things down on paper. I feel like I'd be a lot more productive with my lists if they weren't just in all sorts of places on my laptop and on my phone and in my notes and things like that. So this is a really good calendar for those of you who don't really stick to things on the daily because there aren't any dates in it. You write your own date in here. Um, so it can basically go on forever. And it's got things like objectives for the day, notes to do, projects, timetables, just a really well planned out planner. So I really like that. My mum got me a few books as well. It's kind of become a little bit of a tradition on birthdays and Christmas for her to get me one of these. If you haven't seen these before, they're the Penguin cloth bound classics and there's so so many of them I don't think I'll ever be able to collect all of them um, but they're basically all the kind of classic penguin books um, in these really beautiful covers and they're all different so I have a few I think I have three they're up there on my shelf and this one is Sense and Sensibility by Jane Austen one of my favorites and I just think it's such a stunning really beautiful book to have in my collection so they also got me this giant flask. This is massive and I love this because I try and drink a lot of water but I don't like wasting plastic bottles and buying it all the time and also my tap water here is not great. Um, so I think filling this up and putting it in the fridge is gonna make it taste so much nicer. So this I will be keeping with me on my desk and when I'm working because I always forget to drink water. This one also says do your best, which I love. I'm just gonna think of my mum saying that every time I look at it. Little bit of inspiration for work days there as well. Can you hear that barking in the background? I don't know if my microphone is gonna pick that up, but that is very relevant right now because um, my brother and his girlfriend got me this. This picture of Moon which, I mean, you guys probably know that I am overly obsessed with my own dog. I take more pictures of her than I do of anything else in the world. Um, and this photo is actually one that my brother's girlfriend took herself. It's really, really special. And then they put it in a frame for me and printed it out. Um, so I love stuff like this. I really love super thoughtful, like homemade gifts, things that people really have taken their own time to kind of sit down and make. I just think they're the most special and the most precious. And especially because it's got a picture of my my child inside of it. So Darren's family, Darren's mum and dad, um, got me this really, really beautiful little necklace. I've actually seen these for so many years and I've really loved them. Um, and I just think it was really cute that she remembered that or she just knew that. This is a really tiny, tiny little bumblebee charm on a necklace. It's a silver necklace as well. I love jewelry, you probably know this. Um, and I think getting jewelry on birthdays is so special because every time I wear this now, I'm gonna remember my 25th birthday. I also got this uh, beautiful, beautiful little pendant from Susie, from Susie and Josh. She just gets me. She knows what I love. And this is actually from Catbird, um, who are a brand based in Brooklyn, New York. They do the most beautiful, stunning, really dainty, very pretty jewelry. So this is a little pendant and it's a shape of a moon. It's a kind of crescent gold moon pendant, which is so thoughtful and so sweet. And it is absolutely beautiful. I need to get a chain for it to go on. I can't decide if I want a long one, maybe something a bit shorter. Um, let me know what you think this would look the best on, this little crescent moon. So Darren also got me this. It's the La La Land soundtrack on CD. In my car, I only have a CD player. And I've actually been looking for this for ages and I couldn't find it in any stores for some reason. This is gonna go straight into my car. 
And it's going to be on repeat now, so he's he's probably going to regret that decision. This is all that is going to be playing in there from now on. He also picked me up a diptyque candle. He knows I love diptyque candles, obviously. This smells like Parma violets. It's so, so good. I think they did like a limited edition pink Valentine's Day one that kind of smells similar to this, but... This is amazing. It's kind of very sweet and a little bit floral, um, which isn't the kind of thing I usually like, but oh, it's just so good. I think when this burns as well, it's gonna be amazing. And then because he knows that I love Rose Jam from Lush, the shower gel, and you can actually only get it once every year around Christmas time because it is limited edition. Uh, he went in and he managed to find me this. This is the rosy box and it's actually the only thing you can get rose jam in all year round. So a little tip for all you other rose jam lovers out there. I haven't opened this yet, but I think I'm gonna do it now. This is gonna make my room smell incredible. So in here, there's quite a few different rose kind of pink themed things. This is one of my favorites as well. It's the rose jam. Um, bubble bar um, and then this I think it's a shampoo bar there's a little rose argonoi body conditioner in there too one of these heart bath bombs that I see all the time and I've never actually bought one before and then of course sitting in the bottom a little bottle of rose jam I'm so glad I have this stuff back in my life it's literally my favorite smell ever and now the rest of the room smells like it too which actually I have no complaints about so he also really really spoiled me this year i'm a very lucky girl and very very lucky to have such a kind and generous boyfriend it came inside this really beautiful kind of flowery pattern box this is one of the gucci blooms um card cases in the kind of dusky pink color so it has little pink florals on the outside and then inside it has this kind of dusty pink leather i really like the original kind of gucci print but i also love these like hand-drawn, hand-painted flowers. I adore this so much, it's my ideal purse. It's quite small, so it's almost the size of a card holder, just a little bit bigger, but you can fit coins in there, you can fit all sorts. So thank you so much to Darren for getting this for me because it's the most beautiful, beautiful gift. So that is it, that is all the lovely bits that I got for my birthday this year. I had such a lovely day and it's just bringing back all these memories, opening these up again. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Also, if you're interested in the makeup that I'm wearing today and the makeup that I actually wore on my birthday, that is gonna be coming up for you at the end of the week as well. I just filmed a video on this makeup look. So keep an eye out for that. I will see you then. And that is it for me today. Bye.